of people We've got a late night session here um, as you can see the team is looking pretty powerful since the last time I've got everyone fully evolved I remembered that the new fire type in uh, Scarlet and Violet is Serilage, at least for Violet and Armor Edge for Scarlet, but we got this version, so this is what we're gonna use. And it's pretty good, I think I got a speed boosting nature. Oh no, it's uh, not a very good nature. I could make it hasty if I wanted to, I guess, but I don't know how much that's gonna do for us. But it has SD, Shadow Claw, Flame Charge. That's really all we need. We got Jet Punch, we finally got Zero to Hero. Uh, put Play Rough on this thing. Uh, Palmont's pretty much the same. And we got U-Turn, Home Claws, Power Trick, Night Slash. Alright, so we need to get to taking on some gems because right now I only have three gem badges, believe it or not. So we need to get a move on here. I went ahead and took out all of the Titans, so now I can go to take on the... Paradox Pokemon, I guess, any time, but I really need to get my levels up first, because as of right now, they're really low. I think, hopefully, this is the next gem. So there's two here, and then two up there, and then one more at the bottom. So, let's see how this gem is. Oh, no, don't want to do that. So, we got all the abilities now on our Maridon, which is pretty nice. So, we can jump up high and glide and everything, climb up vertical surfaces. Let's check out the gym. See what type of challenge they got. Ah, here we go. Well now, Emblem Miner. You appear to be progressing well on your gym circuit. This is that kid I've been hearing so much about. Who's this? Hey kiddo, I heard you're like way good at battling, yeah? Not that good. You can't fool me that easily, no need to play humble here. Rika. Rika, at your service. I'm pretty, but no need to be intimidated or anything. Uh, far... She's a little far seashell, is that a... I'm used to facetious, but... You look fun, interesting to glance anyways. Esteemed student. Check this out. Really ratchet up the farther you go. Alright, well, let's see if they can match up to my current uh, scale s set. Or where my Pokemon are scaled at, I mean. The Medali Gym. First pass the gym test. A treasure eatery. The goal is to gather clues to determine the secret dish order from the waiter. Wow. All the regulars season their dishes. Alright, so is this gym leader a chef or something? I should make sure that <clears throat> should make sure that Sarah Ledge is at the top of the party. Because they need more levels. So is that it? We just go to this restaurant and check it out? Uh, treasury is right here. Secret dish. So I just go inside or what? How am I supposed to gather clues? Order the secret menu item. Oh, I don't know anything. Was I supposed to gather info already? I guess I could look it up, but... Omelette. Medium. Extra crispy fire blast style. A lemon. All 
Okay, so I guess we need to go out and ask people around, huh? Geez, so many different things. Okay. What have you got to say, bud? Geez, seriously? Oh, maybe th this dude's eating some. Maybe he's got an idea. He's just eating a sandwich. What have you got to say? Oh, maybe we have to beat the people. Hey, why don't you tell me your secret clue, huh? So the levels are pretty close, actually. Does a heck of a lot. But should be able to take him out. Just need one more hit. Jeez. Yeah, I think this is the one they were talking about that um, people just walk right through the Pokemon. I should probably switch out. I really need another fighting type move on this. Because Arm Thrust just ain't doing it for me. I'm also wondering if I should take Volt Switch out, but I like being able to switch out. Alright, so we should just about take it out in the next turn. I feel like there was a pretty decent level jump from here, from the last one, so maybe the gym nearby will be a, a lower level. So that way we can take them both out. You don't need entrainment, bud. So you're not gonna give me any clues? So that's not how we get clues. Well, what did you have to eat? Seriously, bro, this is difficult. How do we get these clues? They're all eating sandwiches, though. How about it? What's up? What's at the sandwich shop? Man. My A button doesn't seem to want to work because I'm too far away, I guess. That sucks. I'm gonna have to move closer. Okay, now I got it to work. Yeah, everybody's talking about these sandwiches. Nobody wants to tell me about the omelets or anything else in this town. All right, now that I'm much closer to the TV, maybe I can get a better idea of where I'm gonna find these clues. Yeah, yeah, what's the secret dish? Because that first person didn't tell me anything. All my Pokemon are super low too, or just these first two anyways. Oh great, play rough, nice. Come on, bro, they're only level 34. Great, only two hits. Oh, 
All right, Flora Gato, we're gonna need you to clean up. Flower Trick is so good. It looks like base 105 power. Alright, what's the secret ingredient? Do I have to talk to him afterwards? Oh, a, a dark spot surrounded by stairs. Oh, so I have to talk to him each time. Well, this is a dark spot surrounded by stairs. Oh, I was right with Fire Blast. Wow. So, Fire Blast is correct, but I don't know about any of the other stuff. Alright, but now I got a better idea. Oh, and also I figured out how to freaking dash. This whole time I had to press down. I wish I would have known that. Alright. So, that other person I beat. What was your clue? The odd one that. The odd one out at the ice cream stands. Greetings from Kanto. Have a taste of crepes. Is it the rice balls? Is that what it is? That must be it. So, rice balls with a fire blast. Where's the other trainers at? I mean, they have to be in the town, though. Nope, not you. Here we go. I wish I knew what my clue was. I gotta hand it to Game Freak, the oof, Trova. They sure are trying to come up with some creative stuff in terms of how to spice up the gym challenges instead of just having it be puzzles inside the gym itself, or like a trial or something. Alright, there we go, Sarah Ledge. The Bluebird Pokemon. Is there a Bluebird somewhere nearby? It can't be too far away from the guy. Bluebird. Oh, that Bluebird! Hawk a Billy Billy. 
Alright, come on. You got anything? No think, no think. Medium. Okay. Was that the only other person? I mean, did they give me a clue though? Because if I had a clue... Oh, I guess I can go inside and try. But there was like a... Wasn't there four options? I guess I could also guess. Just brute force it at this point now that I know most of them. So it's grilled rice balls. Medium. Oh no, that's it, right? Fire Blast. Oh, the Garnish. Cheese Powder. Okay, let's try it one more time. Well, no, I can Brute Force at this point. It's just two more answers. Fire Blast, Lemon. Let's see if I was right with- okay, that was it. Maybe I subconsciously knew it was Lemon. Did they tell me it was Lemon? Oh, I see. Wait, no, not yet. I need to heal up my mons. Okay. Oh, you know, we'll put Palafin. Because I need to show you guys the power of Palafin. Once it switches in and out. Heck yes. Let's take him on. Oh, Larry was sitting over there the whole time. Hello. I'm Larry. I'm assigned to work as the gym leader. You're assigned? Everything's good here. Are you just like a businessman? My pa my boss will dock my pay if I spend too much time chit-chatting. Wow, so he's just a Norman. Just a normal Larry. Gus Frame. Alright, so all we gotta do is switch in and switch out. Comatose. Can't put any status on it. That's fine. Destruction. be able to set up, so I'll just baton pass hard out. Back out into Aoshima. Zero to hero. A swing and a miss. 
Chef Punch. Has 160 base attack. Oh, the Dunsparce. Let's see how much we can do this thing. Absolutely busted. Of course, I get paralyzed first turn. You gotta be kidding me, dude. Really trying to hack me out here. Wow, and a crit too. Aw oh man, now they're just gonna glare me. Okay, thank you. Who's your last? Who are you going to terrestrialize into? Star Raptor. What would they change into? Because you're a flying type, so you wouldn't turn into a ghost. Necessarily. There's the Intimidate. Come on, Larry, step it up a notch. We've got hungry customers waiting. Give them something to cheer for. Is this dude gonna go Insanio mode? Is he about to undergo a change? <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. I suppose I can put on a bit more of a show. No, he, he stays completely stoic. What's the terrestrialization into? Oh. He went for the offensive route. Going for the quadruple stab. If I live the hit, I can just go for jet punch to win. Are you flame orb? Guess not. All right, jet punch to win. Too easy. All right, and that's that gem badge. Substitute? Who's learning Substitute? You don't need Substitute, bud. You need a move to boost your stats, is that you need. You certainly threw me for a loop. Ah, chin up, Larry. Rather strong, are you? Care to join me for a meal? He said he just ate. This dude loves eating. Is he just a businessman and he's here on his lunch break? 
Oh, and I'll actually listen to you too. Facade. Okay. Don't worry about the bill. I do earn a salary after all. Yeah, he literally just comes here on his lunch break. That's crazy. Hola. Caught you just as he's finished up. Nice work. But I'm gonna have to wait because I put together my team of Pokemon specifically to take on the gym leader, dang it. When I battle you, I want it to be under the best conditions possible. I got to ask, take a rain check. All right. All right, let's see. So to get to the next gym, water type one down here don't really have any locations I can fly to nearby or I can go here but then the thing is I'm not sure about where to go from there when I was gonna battle Arvin after he really actually seems like a cool dude oh and just as I thought uh, Professor Turo was indeed his dad and everyone was talking about how Turo was such like a, what's it called, a uh, everyone's simping over the professor's Giga Chad, but dude straight up left his kid. Literally, he's a horrible father. <laughs> but um, and that's why he wanted to help out his Pokemon so much because his Dark type dog was the only one that ever really. Uh, cared for him and was there for him all that time so I guess I mis misjudged him and then meanwhile the professor looks so cool but re in reality he's just uh, a what's it called you know what I mean a dad that's not there for their kid This is kind of shameful Magikarp. I do like taking on the trainers though, just to try and get whatever item that the guy has. Aracuda. That's the one uh, pre-evolution of Barrascuda, right? Yeah. So is in the game too. Alfredo. Alright. Let's keep it moving. Caracana. Right, I can hear you, gimme ghoul. I wonder if it would be better to switch out the fairy type dog because honestly it's not pulling its weight but everyone else is pulling their weight. I kind of just needed to switch into the dragon type attacks. I wonder... Maybe if I... Oh dang it. I hate running into these wild Pokemon. I don't even know whether they're there. All is just for one gimme ghoul coin. I'm just gonna look where I'm going. I haven't seen a single shiny in this game, by the way. Oh yeah, this must be the one I already took out.
Don't give me that, just need to use your ramp. Is this seriously the only way to get that gimme ghoul? Can't be. What's him? Encore, seriously? Oh wait, I forgot I can climb up vertical surfaces now. That makes things a lot easier. Alright, where was that Pokemon Center at? Mascarafa. Uh, I don't think we're gonna make it there. Alright, up here, Gimme Ghoul. All that, and he wasn't even there. I guess we got the Encore TM. Usually he's like hiding out in the corners, but I don't see him. Oh, he's right here. It took me all that time to find it. That's how tired I am. Let's take out this gym. Hopefully it's not much of a gym challenge. This is one of those elevator things. Nice. Is Namona gonna be here? Valooza Valooza. Where's he going? wallet. A wallet that was left behind. Okay. Oh, he's all the way over here. Right, that's no problem, though. We already took out the Titan of the Desert, so... Don't need to worry about that. All the Titans I was pretty well level 4, except for the last one. But even then I managed. But taking on Arvin at level 58... Oh, that's what I was trying to think. His, his dad's a deadbeat dad. I don't know why it couldn't come to me. But yeah, pretty sad overall. I always figured out I can beast boost. But I don't, I don't know if his dad, if it doesn't really seem like he was being held against his will, or maybe he was, but it's like even when he's talking about his kid, it's like all he can focus on is research. Is it just the one coin? It's gonna take a lot more than that. Alright. 
Oh, a moonstone. Nice. Not a bad idea to get the Pokemon Center around here. Look at that. Tokyo Drift. I'm going too fast to even pick up the items. May as well check it out. I don't know if beating higher star gems uh, gives me more stars here. No. I need to get to the higher star levels. Because you know, that's the only way to get good IV dittos for breeding. And hit abilities and such. Yep, ready to go my Pokemon. Porto Marinata. Let me guess, but you forgot your wallet. Where in the world is my wallet? If you're thinking about trying to interrupt him, I is his best surprise. We'll have to stop you. Super important. So what's your, I guess are they, they're all using water types? Well, that should be su super easy for us. Like, just like I thought, lower level. So yeah, we could have easily taken on this gym before, but that's cool. So this will be number five, right? They really pulled it off though. They made a game that's completely not linear as compared to every other Pokemon game. And I guess you can really see the illusion with that, that Galar was completely linear, a straight line. This one is perfectly circular. You can go anywhere you want. Clauncher, perfect. I was thinking of Crabrawler, but I guess fine, he's acrobatics. Yep, destruction. Just now telling me I arrived at my destination. It's crazy. Well, I've been getting all this cash. I need to spend it on Pokeballs. Tell me what all the ruckus is about. Seems the kid's got something to say. I have your wallet. Valooza, Valooza. My lobby staffer sent you to bring it to me. Huge help. Thanks for coming all this way. Today's last item. The legendary Wakami seaweed of the Hoenn region. Vault Valooza. Jeez, look at those dudes' hands. They're going in 5 FPS. Get the winning bid. I'll give him my best shot. Fighting for the auction. Be smart with it. This ain't. And win this old man that seaweed. 
Nice, 50,000 plus. Thirty-five. <laughs> hey, do you want your change? You still have fifteen thousand left. If there's any money left, feel free to keep it as a tip. Oh. Alright, so that was the gym test, so now we just gotta head back. And when I go back to the Pokemon Center, I'll buy some more stuff, too. Oh, I guess there's a whole market, too. <sighs> but right now, all my cash is going towards Pokeballs for the decks. Haven't been able to catch as many because I've just been out of Pokeballs. Do we have Ultra Balls yet? Alright, could use some Repeat Balls. Still no Ultra Balls. Just take 10 more. Well, we also need hyper potions. Working on super potions. Just about out of potions. I think the potions are good for the auto heals. So there's that gimme ghoul taunting me again. I thought I had you already. Unless, does it come back 30? Yo, I thought they only gave one every time. Well, how many do I have right now? Three fifteen. Okay. Still a long ways to go. Gotta go to all those towers. I thought I had to catch them in order to get them, but I guess I, because that's why I was using more peepals, but I guess I can just knock them out. I already have a, both a timid and a modest one. Of course, I think the best thing to do is probably to breed one. I should probably swap out my Pokemon. May as well just put starter first and home claws up and sweep. All right, are we gonna battle this time? Yeah, let's battle. So, she can scale her Pokemon, it said. Let me pick the right Pokemon for where you're at in your journey. Because you said that... They said that she was already the champion. Or that she achieved the champion rank as the youngest person ever. So the whole time, is she just fine-tuning her Pokemon? Where'd you go? Ah, 
I thought she'd be down here. This is what spamming it gets me. Muscle band, hang on. So do I have to report to the lobby first and then take her on? Let me swap on my Pokemon real quick. Dang it, keep talking too fast. I should put Nightingale first. Then I'll just Volt Switch out. I guess I take on Nimona after. Seems like the water type gym leaders are always chefs or the water type trainers. This is the blues I've been hearing about. Mold breaker, interesting. Destroyed. Take our extra sweep from here. Old trio. setback. I don't see why they had it for eight generations and got rid of it all of a sudden. I think this should still kill. Or maybe I should have terastalized. Are you going to become a water type? That's what happened every single time. 
They always transform into a type that's super. It's the same type as their gym. Yep. Good night. Easy sweep. I would have taken on this gym earlier if I knew it was at this level. number five. Chilling water. again ah oh, here we go they finally got their team running champion Nimona La Primera with Emerald Miner yeah why do you call because she's just that. She's the real number one, even higher than us regular champions. She's the top champion. You can't go stealing him from me. Yeah, so I don't get it. You're already a champion. Why are you doing the gym badges again? She said, yo, I gotta go into my boxes. I gotta change up my team real quick. I feel you on that. Face it. Final challenge to become a champion. One moment. Ah, oh, thank you. I appreciate it. All right. Let's see what you got, Nimona. So no matter what, her Pokemon are going to be scaled towards mine, right? No matter where we're at. This always happens after battle number five. I guess they're a little bit scaled, yeah. We'll switch out. So that should be in range of flip turn, right?
Yeah, I don't get it. She picked a starter too, didn't she? Skadoosh. Alright, Palafin. Eating it up. You don't even have Palmont? Come on. You gotta walk those 1,000 steps. I only ever found out about Palafin because of that one video Blunder did, but ever since I found out about it, oof, I knew I had to go get one and train it up as fast as possible. You see in this premiere I'm getting backed into a corner. Oh no, it's a water fighting type, what am I going to do? Wait a minute, she's gonna terastalize into a pure water type and lose her fighting type. It's fine though, it's not like she can do anything against me. That's a 2 a KO. What could you possibly do against me? Aqua Step. Eating it up. Even if you raise your speed, it's not gonna watch this. Okay, almost. Jeez, a crit. Oh, that wasn't even a crit. I don't know why. It seemed like it did more. And down you go. Okay, I got more TMs. You're gonna become a champion, no doubt about it. She hopes you'll truly might you truly might rival her. Yeah, catch up to her. That's what I'm saying. She's got so many more Pokemon just chilling in the in the box. Alright people, well, we got two more gym badges and we took on Namuna. I think that's a pretty successful episode for today. So, I'm sorry if the audio was a little bit low, I'm just trying to 
stay quiet because it's late at night. But let's go ahead and save real quick. And be sure to like, comment, subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.